Hey, it's Ben again, and welcome back to another video. It is a beautiful, balmy 70 degrees here in Wisconsin, and I believe today is November 8th. That is not okay with me because the weather is way the hell too nice, and we are just getting spoiled. But that means I can ride this thing a little bit more. Fun fact, I made this video already. We're gonna go to a slightly different place than where the last video I recorded was. But I recorded this video about a week, maybe two weeks ago. I don't even know anymore. And I thought it was a great idea to just change all my settings on my GoPro. And it totally, <laughs> it totally killed the footage. Everything is overexposed. Nothing is usable. All you can see is the road and some trees. The sky is completely white and that's it. So we're out here today making another video in the beautiful weather. I actually bought a new toy that I really hope to show off in this video. Uh, that's a secret and you will find out about it. I was supposed to meet a girl today for ice cream first date type stuff um, I messaged her a couple times today and she was responding just fine she does have stuff going on in her life so no big deal whatever but I just asked her if she still wanted to meet up and she did not respond and because it's on snapchat you know I can see whether or not she read it and she read it so I just took that as, hey, we're not hanging out. You can't fault someone for just, you know, not being 100% sure of what they want. I know I wanted to hang out with her, but who knows if she wanted to hang out with me or not. Only she does. It sucks a little bit, but life goes on and you just learn to get over it, things like this, because it's not a big deal. I don't really know her, but I would love to get to know her. She seemed pretty cool. Oh well, her loss. What is the point of making plans and actually like picking a time and a day only to flake? Like if you think you're gonna flake, why not just tell somebody? Why not be like, hey, I just don't think we're gonna be compatible. I would rather do something else with my time. Or, you know, hey, I'm actually busy today. I don't have time to meet up with you. That's so much more okay and acceptable than the just blowing them off and not responding thing. But enough about this random girl that I've never actually met and probably won't meet at this rate. <laughs> Unless she changes her mind and wants to hang out. We'll see, but I'm not going to pursue it too hard. You just can't push things like that. I, I mean, maybe I'll just talk to her for a bit get to know her some more through messaging and then if we do get to know each other great if we don't that's fine I feel like with technology being the way it is and the way people are today we need that instant gratification so it'd be really nice to be like hey we're hanging out right now fantastic cool you're my girlfriend bam and it's all said and done and you know life is great but that's not how the real world works. I mean, you usually have to build relationships and stuff happens over time. So you can't just get down and out about one little thing that didn't happen. Fuck. Hi. She looked the wrong way. What a fucker. <laughs> Damn. Where I'm going, I don't know if it's private property, public property, whatnot. I'm gonna try and find a park. And test out my new toy.
gentlemen, there you have it. There is the new toy. I bought myself a drone. And I hope that footage wasn't absolute garbage because I had 17 different things go wrong. The, uh, the storage filled up. I got a high wind warning, so it was rough to fly. That might have been because I was really high. I don't know. It just was not great. <laughs> and then when I returned it to clear out some storage, the gimbal wouldn't move and I don't know what all happened. It's brand new to me. I've only flown it like four times. I love the damn thing. It's a beautiful thing. But yeah, I recommend everybody get one if you can afford it and you like cameras and making films and stuff because it is so much fun and it's like a whole new challenge that you don't know you need but now you know you need it so i'm off to try and find another place before that sun goes all the way down just to get some cool video Why is it 25? That's why. <laughs> I'm gonna get pulled over now. <laughs> wow. why that cop didn't pull out after me it was 25 I was still going 40 according to my speedometer <laughs> I was definitely going more than the speed limit whatever I'll take that as a win thank you police officer you're a cool dude the view is about to be spectacular ladies and gentlemen that's all I can say <laughs> yeah! Hills, 45 miles an hour. Bet. Oh, that is just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. We're just gonna go straight until we can't go straight anymore. And then we're gonna stop. We're gonna whip out that drone. And hopefully do nothing illegal. Dead end? That's exactly what I want. I 
as you can see from that beautiful sunset, the sun is going down. We got all of our cool cinematic stuff. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm gonna hop back on this beast right here. We're gonna ride home. It's starting to get dark, especially in this tinted visor. So yeah, you guys have a fantastic day. I wanna keep getting my gear on. I really hope all this stuff turns out. I love you guys. Bye. My God, I should not be staring at the sun right now. But it's just so pretty.